what is going on people welcome back to another video on aj5 and in today's video guys we do have an update on polymath which has pumped up as you guys can see 23 percent in the last 24 hours and it is currently trading at just under 17 cents so we're going to be looking at is it going to keep pumping over the next couple of hours days or is it going to drop back down in value so is it time to buy it is it too late should you sell it on a profit or is it simply time to hold on to it so we are going to cover both buyers and sellers point of view as well as both short-term and long-term investors looking at its prediction over the next couple of hours days weeks months and overall in 2023 how high and how low can polymath go and is it a crypto worth investing into this year but before i get into all of that stuff guys if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet make sure to go down and smash the subscribe button as well as like the video as i am trying to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target i will be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry follow me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so as you guys can see we are currently on the coinbase website the market is down just about a percentage however we do have polymath as the first gainer or top gainer shall i say in the last 24 hours according to coinbase so zooming into the hourly chart on polymath we can see it has gained six percent in the last hour itself over the last day 40 percent most of the pump did come from earlier this morning over the last week 43 percent and over the month 51 percent even though it has been quite volatile over the last four weeks as you guys can see most of the increase did come from the last 24 hours so going into the coin market cap website here we can see the trading volume has gone up massively guys six thousand percent increase in the last 24 hours making it just about two million dollars meaning a huge huge amount of people have been looking into the project and a huge increase guys meaning is one of the top gainers in the last 24 hours so of course we are going to see a lot more people trading the crypto a lot more people buying selling and so on so it is getting a lot of attention and a lot of hype around it so yes guys the trading volume is likely to go even higher over the coming hours so let's get straight into it on the screen right now we do have the candlestick pattern chart with the fibonacci scale which i'm going to be using later on in the video to do some technical analysis but for now i'm just going to hide this and i'm going to bring out the usual macd indicator to do some price prediction as i'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for so we are looking at the daily chart and at the top here we've got the purple line running across the chart which is the sma indicator giving us the average value of polymath which is here in purple at 14 cents however we can see it trading at a much higher value here in green at nearly hitting 20 cents meaning it's performing quite well and much better than expected so what i'm going to do now is zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short-term traders and then i'll move on to the hourly daily and weekly chart for the long-term investors like myself but before i do that guys just a little disclaimer as usual this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor anything i say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make i will not be responsible for so zooming into the 30 minute chart we do have the blue and the orange line looking quite bullish heading towards a positive direction however they are looking quite steep meaning it's not realistic the only reason why it's looking so steep is because of the major increase that's taken place over the last couple of hours the graph thinks you know what this crypto is going to keep pumping is going to keep going up in value so on and so on however that is not the case what i am expecting over the next 12 to 14 hours is for it to drop back down in value to around 16 cents is what i'm expecting polymath to be trading at in the early hours of tomorrow don't get me wrong over the next couple of hours it is likely to pump up even higher to about 22 23 cents but once it does hit that target over the next let's say towards the end of the day today early hours of tomorrow it is very likely to slowly start to drop down in value to around 16 to 17 cents is where i'm expecting polymath to be trading at in the early hours of tomorrow now moving on to the hourly chart very similar we've got the blue and the orange line looking very bullish looking quite steep as well going in a bullish direction meaning once again it's not realistic so exact same applies here over the next seven to eight days so let's say towards the end of this week early next week i'm expecting polymath to have gone for an overall drop in value potentially trading around 14 to 15 cents is where i'm expecting this crypto to be trading at towards the end of this week so do expect green days and red days over the next seven days up and down but the overall outcome seems to once again be more on the negative side rather than the positive side now 
Moving on to the daily chart, again, we're looking quite steep once again, meaning it's not realistic. However, in this case, guys, over the next six to eight weeks, so mid to late September 2023, I am expecting an overall increase in value from Polymath, potentially hitting about 40 cents is where I'm expecting Polymath to be trading at in September. So approximately over the next two months, we should see an average double up in value from this crypto however that is only if the crypto market manages to stay on the green side and again that is only if bitcoin manages to pump up over $35,000 as well so yeah these are my takes over the next couple of hours days weeks and months as well so yeah at the moment of the short term is not looking too great but over the next couple of months is is looking quite good slow and steady increases so let's get rid of the macd indicator and bring on the fibonacci scale and as you guys can see polymath has pumped up over 20 cents right now so yeah it is likely to pump up a little bit higher as you can see getting very close to 21 cents and then drop back down in value but look if we do get the fibonacci scale out we can see we are still trading in the red zone and have been trading in the red zone for quite a while over a year now yes there was this one point where we had a major pump late last year but it straight away dropped back down in value and right now we need to aim for 38 cents for us to hit the green zone which i'm not expecting from polymath anytime soon but as i mentioned earlier in the video september october time we should be able to more or less head into the green zone resist from here and then potentially drop back down in value to around 30 cents towards the end of the year but potentially towards the very very end of the year or very early next year we should be able to break out the red zone and head into the green zone but again this depends on how the crypto market performs with any major pumps or crashes that take place anything like that i'm here to keep you guys updated on a daily basis on what to expect and what to predict on the crypto market so make sure you guys stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time i upload but yeah this is my take on polymath guys what i want you guys to do is let me know in the comment section down below how high are you guys expecting this crypto to go in 2023 and can it hit the green zone this year comment down below as i'm very intrigued to see how many of you guys are bullish and how many of you guys are bearish on this crypto and on that note i'm gonna end the video here guys i just want to say a massive thank you to every single one of you who have been subscribing liking commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form and especially all the subscribers out there thank you guys so much as it helps me out a lot and means a lot to me as i am trying to hit 100k by the end of the year and at the end of the day guys it is free to subscribe so why don't you go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video and if you guys do have any other cryptocurrencies in mind that you guys want me to cover on this channel make sure to comment them down below as well and i catch all of you guys in my next crypto to update we should hopefully be later on today or tomorrow until then take care and peace